Now, what would happen if six random Rust players lived on a boat together? Well, today, we're going to be trying a little bit of a social experiment. See, just recently, Rust released the Tugboat. This is a boat which allows you to build inside of it. With the exception of electrical items and electricity, you can place almost anything you want on these things. Now, I've come up with a pretty simple but ambitious plan. My goal is to build a hostel on one of these boats. Now, there's only one room per tugboat that you can actually build inside of. So this is not going to be a hotel because our guests are not going to have their own rooms. Instead, each guest will receive a sleeping bag and a private locked box. The plan is to take control of a tugboat and scour the freshborn areas in search of nakeds that wish to ditch the land for the wipe and live on a boat. Six completely random naked Rust players spending the wipe on a boat together. This Rust adventure takes trust to a whole new level. So without further ado, buckle up. This is going to be a hectic ride. All right, everyone. I'm jumping on Rustoria. There's 994 players on this server. Wish me luck. Hello. Hello there. Bonjour. Okay. What's on your what's on your what's on your side? Just the binoculars, mate. Take them. Thank you, bro. Hello there. I just met your neighbor. He seems like a cool guy. He lives over there. Maybe go and start an alliance. The two of you could take the whole server over. Okay. Bye-bye. I like how his name is Who Ask. <laughs> now, as you can probably tell, I'm in a little bit of a friendly mood today on Rust. And that's great because, well, I'm about to meet somebody that could use a little help in hand. Okay, I'm heading to the river. I'm going to grab some food and then we're heading up towards the harbor. Player. Hello, sir. I have a decision to make. Should I take your life or should I spare you? What is this? It's a bandage. How are you doing Thank today? Thank you. Man. No problem. Thank you. Where are you from? I'm fine. I just downloaded Rust. What? Really? You just downloaded the game? No way. Yeah. Hey, I'll invite you to a team. Press tab and then press accept. And if you need any help, type in the team chat. Okay, okay. Awesome. So all you need to do is press enter and then press tab and you'll be able to... Ah! Welcome to Rust. Doesn't matter how nice you are. Doesn't matter who you are. Nobody can avoid the sneaky double barrel to the back of the head. But I did manage to get the team invite out to this new player. Say hello to White Smith. Apparently, he's only just downloaded the game and by pure coincidence... He has the same name as me. We both have Smith as our last name. Let's go see if we can catch up with White Smith because I've got a pretty cool idea. We got wrecked, bro. <laughs> Welcome to Rust. How you doing, bro? Now, my plan is to eventually live on a boat. So I'm going to live near Harbor. So if you want, you can build a base next to me. I'll help you build it. Okay, bro. Try something. Let's no, go, I'm mate. Oh, <laughs> okay. It's okay. If you need to type, then then type. Okay, we're just going to have to avoid all of the people with guns. Let's start collecting wood, bro. Now, the original plan that I thought of was to let White Smith live next to me and kind of help him through the early stages of the game. But then I thought of a better idea. See, the whole point of today's video is to build a hostel on a boat. And the one key and very important element of this is going to be trust. So, instead of White Smith living next to us, I'm going to share a base with White Smith instead. The plan is to build a base with two separate entrances. On one side of the base will be my entrance, and on the other side will be White Smith's entrance. And in the middle of the base will be a tool cupboard that we'll both have access to, protected by two windows. We won't be able to access each other's side of the base, but we will be sharing a tool cupboard together. Before we take this to the next level and live on a boat out in the ocean with six random people, we're going to try a little proof of concept and see if we can trust this new Rust player right here, White Smith, by sharing a base with him. Okay, now I'm going to tell you something about Rust. <clears throat> when it's night time, you can't do anything. We just have to sit here <laughs> and hide. I have an idea, like, hmm. Maybe we could build our base 
we could share a base but have different doors like on each side of the base yeah so like one side of the base is mine and one yeah. side of the base is yours well let's collect about three thousand wood each in the when it gets to morning and then that should be enough oi, oi, run, run, run. okay we're okay we're good we're good now, Whitesmith and I got separated several times whilst trying to build this base. It's a hectic server. But eventually, I found this very dense forest right here. It's located somewhat close to the harbor, which is great because that's where the tugboats spawn. But it's also somewhat hidden away, so it's solo friendly. I'm going to get started building the base whilst Whitesmith starts making his way over here. Perfect little forest. I will start by placing the tool cupboard, and then I can just continue farming. My roommate is making his way over here. He's kind of all the way at the bottom of the map. Ah, hello. Hello. Okay, one moment. Quick right. up, though. I'll show you my plan. Okay, um, I'm going to unlock this, authorize, and I'm going to lock it again. Okay. Now follow me. In fact, I'll un I will have a code lock on this at some point once we've got a furnace. Place this door and this lock on here. Okay, now how this is going to work is I'm going to place a window. Like, I'm going to place a window there and a window on my side. So we can yep. both access the tool cupboard, okay. but we can't access each other's loot. And so, yeah, okay. I... it's pretty cool. And also, you can eventually craft a window so that you can block this off with a window. And you can pick up the window whenever you want. We're sharing a base. We're roommates. Let's go, man. Let's Where go. Where is your sleeping bag? Take that. I don't currently have a sleeping bag. Thank you. I don't know if I can trust this guy, but we're going with it. All right, so then now, let's just do some farming. And, uh, yeah. So there we have it. I'm doing something that definitely goes against the grain in Rust. And I'm trusting a random person that I just met. Let the adventures commence. There's someone. There's someone. Someone killed me. Someone killed me also. Rest in peace. Now, there's a few things that you guys should keep in mind. First and foremost, I'm not going to talk around the base. The last thing you want to happen is that people find out there's a YouTuber playing on the server. That's a one-way ticket to seeing your base blown up. Okay, mate. Should we go on our first adventure? Yeah. Okay, I've got my spear, mate. Are you ready? Okay, wait. I'm... Okay. See if you can grab this through the window. I'm going to throw it through. Nice. Oh, he forgot to close his door. Don't forget to close your door, man. <laughs> All right, let's go, mate, to the uh, gas station. If we die, we die. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Watch out, watch out, watch out. I've got some food for you, Smith. Somebody's placed a trap base right next to the uh, supermarket. <laughs> okay, let's just go inside, and we're going to quickly... Oh, we're going to quickly use the recycler and leave. Oh, no. It's gonna explode. One down. Throw it. Oh, close. Sorry, we'll let him. We'll let him go. We got his friend. Okay, I'm gonna quickly recycle. See if you can loot any boxes or find anything, any barrels or anything. Nice. Pop them inside the recycler, mate. We'll split the loot halfway when we get back. No naked. Hello. Okay, let's go. Um, take this and craft bandages. We made it back, boys. Is this my side of the base or his? This is mine. Okay, good. Nice little run there. Small trips as per usual. And we're almost ready to craft one sheet metal door. We really ideally need a furnace. Got him. Yep. 
a furnace. Do I have any new skins? Yes, I do. I have a charcoal furnace skin, which looks pretty cool. Okay, we'll grab that. Okay, let's go, mate. We need metal ore. Let's just go in the cave. Okay, all we need now is wood. That's all we need. Awesome. You all need a roof up here as well. Yeah. Hello, I'm good. Okay. Five thousand. Okay, we officially have a full stone base. So you can you can do whatever you want. You can expand your base. You know you can do whatever. You've kind of screwed yourself over with the mailbox. Yeah. Oh, you can you can destroy it if you need to. Okay, okay. with a hatchet. But it Why just is this bad? Because you can't expand the base. Hello. Hello. How you doing? You can't expand your base. Oh, okay. Hello. Yeah. I'm fine. Hello. Hello there, Oscar. Are you good? Okay. Hello. 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 Yeah. How are you? I am good. Goodbye. Okay. This is case in point. You see this Oscar guy? I knew by the way he was acting that he sensed something. So instead of going back into the base, I ran away because I didn't want Oscar to know where I lived. And sure enough, Oscar followed me and... Oh my God. Boys! Oh. <laughs> I literally just watched the video. Find me? No, like. <laughs> no, wait, wait. wait. <laughs> I literally. <laughs> Bro! I literally watched your video, like yesterday. How did I not guess that? Okay, thank you, thank you. I literally follow you. Well, thank you, boys. Bro, I love you. I Where love are you guys from? Uh, we're, we're both from Sweden. 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 Oh, nice, man. Okay, I'm gonna put you in the video. You seem like cool guys. Yeah, okay, okay. But thank oh. you. Really? Why oh, not? Oh, I love you so much. Okay. Well, thank oh, you. Shit. Right. Oh, love you so much. Thank you, bro. You're the best. Oh, crap. Yeah. We're gonna die. Run. Now, Oscar and his friend seemed cool, but you never know on this game because there's a lot of bad apples as well. You don't want a bad apple knowing where you live, especially if you uh, make YouTube videos because they just want the attention and they will ruin your wipe. So you have to be careful. But shout out to Oscar and his friend. Well, White's logged out. It was awesome meeting him. Just randomly stumbled upon him. And 10 minutes later, we're living in the same base together. <laughs> but this is a sort of taster of the hostel. I'm testing whether it works. You know, it's a social experiment. And it probably doesn't work unless you meet a brand new Rust player like I just did, who's completely innocent and hasn't been corrupted by the brutality of this game. Now, day number one was a success. We are officially sharing a base with a random stranger that we just met. Now, I've got some big goals for day number two that I'd like to achieve with this base. Firstly, I would like to create a connection from my side of the base to White Smith's side of the base using the pipe system so that we can transport loot, resources, add electric furnaces, etc. without having to enter each other's side of the base. In layman's terms, I want to electrify the base and automate the base as well. This will be the last day that White Smith and I will be sharing a base together, so I want to make sure that it's kitted out in case White Smith wants to remain here alone before I head out onto the seas to turn this experiment into a business. Oh, oh, the base has got 53 hours on it. Oh, and he's added two more boxes. He has come online and he has put stuff in the TC. You absolute legend, White Smith. Do you hear me now? Yes, I hear you. Hello. Good morning, bro. Good little kill there. Didn't have much, but we'll take it. He was running towards me aggressively. Give me whatever you had. Oh, missed. Oh, we got him. Sorry once again. Actually had some decent loot. Might as well recycle while we're here. Give me that water pipe, mate. Okay, bro, I've got the cloth for you. Let's go take let's go visit that hotel. Yo, that's huge. I was mining, so I got like 3,000 of stones, too. 
Oh, nice, nice. Now, the great thing about sharing a tool cupboard with somebody is, well, one of us can focus on one task and the other can focus on another. In this particular situation, Whitesmith has found that he quite enjoys going and farming down in the cave, which we live next to. Meanwhile, I'm going to focus more on the scrap grind. Oh, also, somebody's built a hotel on the server. Okay, I'm ready. All right, let's go to the hotel. Uh, okay. No, nice, nice. Door camper. Kill. Okay, nice, nice. Come out. Are you alive? I'm coming. Yeah, I got his revolver. He was door camping us. Uh, nice. I'll store the revolver away for now. Okay, there, there's, there's naked, 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 naked. It's going crazy out here at the moment. Okay, I got my friend's bow, that's the main thing. Oh, I'm gonna heal up. Okay, I'm finally here. Boom, boom, boom. Well, let's hope that we don't get killed too fast. This hotel is going to be crazy. Watch out for the wolf. Okay. No wolf. It's just the wolf. It's just the wolf. This way. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, God. Oh, look. There's, there's fireworks from the hotel. Let's go. Ooh. Oh. We get the seat. Yeah, dude. There it is. Oh, my God. Let's try and not die straight away. But are we supposed to kill them or not? No, 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 no. We're, oh, we're, oh. Yeah. So we are going to be friendly. We're gonna try. Okay. Oh, there's a tugboat as well. Hello. Very nice hotel. Hello. Hello. You all right? Oh. oh! You killed my friend! I have your special skin, bro. Hell yeah. <laughs> it's, uh. I think he got edge shot. Jordan Ranch? Wait, wait, who is it? Where is he? Wait, wait, let's see him. That's Jordan Ranch! Oh, oh, okay, okay, guys, okay. Mate, this is massive! Yes. Have you got peacekeeper turrets in here? Wait, wait Jordan Ranch? Yes. Hey. Yes. Hi. Hello. Yeah, I'm, oh. I know you. Take a oh, you, made a you made a video. Yeah, yeah do, you, do you want a room at the hotel, Captain Smith? Or? No, I, I got my base. We just came to check it out, you know? When I, when I, when I find out there's a hotel on the server, I gotta check it out. Oh, absolutely. You should come back tomorrow, man. It's gonna be super nice. Eight stories tall, some bulls. Oh, bring dude. A, bring a bunch of girls over. Oh, oh it's gonna be a good time. Guys, I need to go back to my teammate. I love you, video. I love you, guys. I love you. Thank you. I love you. Thank you. I love you. Hey, thank you for building awesome you hotels, man. You, and being good on Rust. Later! All right, I must say, these things are always hectic. And why did you have to kill my friend White Smith? But either way, kudos for building a hotel, guys. These are the types of things that make each wipe original and memorable. Hopefully you guys last the wipe. All right, back to getting stuff done. Welcome. I don't know why they killed you, man. But yes, it was pretty I crazy. Yeah, oh, there's a guy with bow. Got him. Okay, nice. He was camping all the time. Like, Oh, he's actually got some good loot. That's, uh... Grab it all. Yeah. And, and his bow as well. His bow should be on the ground. I can, I can I can take a bow. Yeah. He was camping that whole time. I don't Jesus. Know. I don't know if we'll use this, but we have one of these. One of Oh. oh. We can make our own voicemail cuz we live together. Yeah. Okay, this is what we're going to say, okay? I'm oh, going to say was... This is the Smith's residence. And then you'll go, "Unfortunately, we cannot take your call right now. This is the Smith's residence." You're supposed to say we cannot You're supposed to say we cannot take. <laughs> Yo, wait, something I couldn't uh, use my uh, microphone. Oh. <laughs> Can you do it again? Okay, wait, 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 uh, wait. This is the Smith residence. Yes, 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 yes. Unfortunately, we uh, wait. Unfortunately, we won't. Three, two, one. Unfortunately, Man, we cannot take your call you... right now. That's what we're we doing. We can't take. We can't okay. take your call. Yeah. O okay. Okay. Two, one. Two, two one. This is the Smith's residence. Unfortunately, we can't take your call. All right. blah, 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 blah. Wait. <laughs> Please have... leave a message yeah. after the tone. Okay, wait. We have to wait for the recording. But nice. This is the Smith's residence. Unfortunately, we can't take your call. All right. blah, 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 blah. Wait. <laughs> Please yeah. leave a message yeah. after the tone. 
All right, perfect. And then we just put the cassette in there. And then once we've got electricity, we'll 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 have right. it all up. Good. Oh, got it. That was well played by me. You got to admit it. That was skill. Adios. You stupid lucky idiots. That was skill. Okay, I'm at the harbor. Recycle lads. Really quickly. Boom, boom. Boom, boom. Okay, recycling complete. Didn't get as much as I thought we would, but all good. 70 scrap in total. Well, 63 actually. We'll make it 70 right now. Okay, that'll do. Let's go home. Okay, we're going to make small trips. There's 67 scrap right there. Okay, I'm going to start researching right now. Let's get to the solar panel. Hello, mate. How are you? You're dying quite a lot I, today. I, 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 <laughs> yeah, I was in the dome and they killed me. And me, I found me, a bear rug. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. Can you help? Can you help? Can you help me? Can you help me? Can you help me? That's my base. 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 Okay, I have a large box now. One. This is the Smith residence. A guy with a revolver. No, 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 no. Okay, one more. With a revolver. Okay, he, have, he had a lot of scrap. I mean, a lot of. Uh, 30. Is that all he had? 30 scrap? Yeah, uh, yeah. He also had a uh, metal pipe. Okay, we keep, keep, let's keep running. Yeah, yeah. Run in. Keep running. I got hit. This way. No, another guy. Another guy. I hit him. I hit him. We're gonna have to run. We're being chased. He's running. On the right. Come this way. White Smith, this way, this way, this way, this way. Ah. Oh. Coming. He was too busy looting a box. Okay, not bad. You did oh. good. You did good. So. The only thing I would say, you know, when we're when we're fighting, don't loot any boxes or anything, you know? We just need to focus on the fight. Okay, okay, you so, know. Uh... You did good though. Yeah. And we, we were flanked by those two guys. I, I kept an eye on them. So when you started yeah. chasing that one guy. There was two guys coming behind. That's why I said we needed to run. But it, well, actually, you did really well. You got some good hits, man. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm crafting more crossbows now. I'm going to craft uh, six. Now, any experienced Rust player will tell you, it doesn't matter how bad you are at this game. The key to success is persistence. This is something I wanted to pass on to White Smith. The goal was to take over Lighthouse. And on our first attempt, we died. Uh, uh, what about maybe I should craft nail gun? What, what do you think? Yes, nail gun's amazing. Or you would have killed it? them with that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It you, you know, it's amazing. Crossbow nail gun setup. If we both go out with that, we'll be destroying everyone. Killed this guy. Another guy. Another guy behind me. I'm at HP. Now on our second attempt, we also died. But see, every time you fail, you slowly get better and better. See, there's a reason why Rust has so many refunds. Most people can't deal with the initial learning curve that this game has, but this game wouldn't be fun without that challenge. So, third time's a charm. Rip. Oh, I'm getting out of here. That probably wasn't the play that it was hyped up to be. This, in fact, is the play. Nail work gun versus nail gun. Oh, this guy's some good stuff. And an awesome rock skin, which I've never seen before. Must be new. What can I say, boys? A kill's a kill. Some good efforts there at Lighthouse, anyhow. All right. About time I started upgrading this base a little bit. Let's power this baby up and get some electricity in here. Okay. Tier 2 workbench is being bought. Awesome. Off you go, drone. Tier 2 is here. Alright, now we just gotta get back to base and start dying. Ooh, we made it! With the Tier 2! 
our closest neighbors being raided, so I've reskinned my door to the regular sheet metal door to make us less of a target. And when Whitesmith gets on, I need to reskin his door as well. Here, I'll, I'll sit right here, Ben. I'll sit right here. Unlock the door real quick. Okay, perfect. Here, here, my teammates want to get off the server, so come up in the front door and just have eyes. I just spawned in, so I don't have a little bot. I'm being dead ass. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving you. Hey, there's another guy out here. That's me. We live in the same base. We're roommates. <laughs> he did, he gave us his stuff. Hey, take it, it's yours. Hello, sir. I'm your neighbor. Would you like to be friends? No. Do you have a microphone? Uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I want to be friends. Sounds good. Okay, sweet. Are you solo? Or have you got friends? Nah, I'm solo. All right, I've invited you. We live right We live right next door. Press tab and then press accept. There we go. You did it now. You did. Cool. Here, take this. It's a crazy right. area around here. Use the flame turret as a, as a, as a thing in your base. Okay, mate, let me explain how this works. Take that window off a moment. Any any metal ore, um, sulfur ore, high quality ore that you place in the tool cupboard will automatically get transported into this electric furnace and then automatically back to the tool cupboard. In other words, any metal or sulfur oh. ore that you get, just place it in the tool cupboard and the, this, the base will do the rest for you. Fully automated system. Now that we've managed to accumulate a decent chunk of resources, research a bunch of stuff on the tier 2 and tier 1 workbench, as well as electrify and automate this base for White Smith. It's almost time to bid farewell to the land and go and try and take over a tugboat. Before we do that though, there's one more thing left to do, and that's to take White Smith on his first satchel raid. Alright, go ahead and check outside. Okay, it seems clear. Over my side. Okay, let's go. Let's go, but let's look on the skies on the roof. They yeah, oh no, we don't need to worry about that because if we go this okay. way, we won't be in line of sight of the roof camper. You died, right? No, I killed him. Oh, you did? Yeah, he had like uh, lots of ammo, but I don't know where is his weapon. All right, grab it all. Come down here, man. Okay, he had, he had Tommy. He had Good Tommy. freaking Maybe job, man. Oh, you should have grabbed his hazmat, mate. Yeah, but it's like one HP, so it's not worth it. Oh, it is? Okay, okay. Right, let's he go. had a lot of medical surgeries. Like mate, he... good job. Uh, is Tommy better than uh, semi-automatic? Yes. It, so it will I'm... be for you. And I have a lot of ammo. That was a good kill, mate. He would have destroyed... Right, drop some meds for me and then keep some for yourself. Yeah. That'll do. I think it may have been... Yes, here it is. This one. Okay. Okay, uh, I'll drop four satchels. You can throw them. Right, it's all open in here. Oh, the TC's pretty good. Okay, I'm taking. Then what we do is we put a we put a door and a lockdown um, okay. in a moment. I'm just I'll I'll cover the entrance. You grab the loot. Everything. Yes, you can hold H to loot everything quickly. Okay, but I'm full actually. Okay, and then I'll, can you I'll take? come. Look yeah. if we can. Code is five five four one. Okay. There's just some metal in there, and then in this box there's some components. And there we have it. 
My little social experiment, teaming up with a random new Rust player, has worked out. We built a pretty cool automated base together, got some nice kills, progressed through to tier 2 workbench, and finished it off with a nice satchel raid. All in the course of one and a half days. Now begins the next adventure, living out on the ocean. Now the first thing we need to do, it's pretty obvious, but we need to find a tugboat. So, we're heading out onto the seas. And sure enough, these things are not hard to come by. Oh, there's a tugboat. Crap. I wonder if I can kill whoever's on it. Probably not. Oh, no way. It's got, oh, it's got armored. Oh, and all the furnaces and the tier one and everything. That is freaking cool. Oh, crap. All right. There's our first encounter with a moving tugboat. And I have to say, these things look awesome. Not only can you build inside of the tugboat, but apparently you can build on the outside as well. Now I headed straight back out in search of another tugboat. This time, hopefully one that's not moving. Is that a tugboat? Oh, there's two. Yes. Okay, one of the tugboats looks absolutely screwed. And that's the one that's kind of lifted out of the water. Okay, well that tugboat's got doors on it. There's another tugboat actually at the fishing village. Okay, so that tugboat's got armored doors on it, which means we'd have to use a lot of satchels. And there's another tugboat over at the fishing village. We could raid this one. The problem is it's at the safe zone. So I don't exactly know how I'm going to raid it. This is the one we've got to raid, man. We got to... Oh, I've got to raid this. Where are we? We're here at the fishing village. Okay, I'll put a marker down. Look at this. Can I see through? There's nobody asleep in that part. And there's another tugboat. There's so many tugboats on this server. If we wanted to raid this, we wouldn't be able to at this moment in time because it's uh, it's in a safe zone. So we'd have to like push it away if possible. Is that even possible? I don't think it is. So hang on, if you've got a tugboat at the safe zone, you're pretty much unraidable. Is, is that what I'm getting here? Okay, what about the tugboat over there? That one's also got a sheet metal door on it. Right, there's loads of tugboats around here. You know what? I'm gonna craft a rifle. And I'm going to raid one of these tugboats. That one over there is raidable. Let's do this. Now, we've got our goal set on raiding this tugboat out in the ocean. I headed back to base to craft more satchels and prepare for the raid. But we're definitely going to need a little help in hand here. So I'm bringing with me Whitesmith and one of the best base builders in all of Rust, Blizzard ID. Okay. All right. Blizzard, hello. Hello, hello. This is my friend who I met like three days ago. Uh, I call him White Smith. Hello, hello. Yo, I put all, not all, uh, almost all my call in a TC. Can you take it? Yeah, yeah, it's fine. You, you don't need to put that. Well, that, that's fine. That's fine. I, I don't have a lot of inventory, but that's fine. All right, we're almost ready to go then. We've got eight satchels, which is enough to get through two you doors. Can you give me the, the server in the bag? Yeah, I'll put it in the Discord, and we'll give you a base tour. The only last thing I need to craft is um, some more ammo, I think. Maybe, can you craft two flashlights as well? Yeah, no problem. You're the flashlight guy. So we've kind of like got different, we've been getting different blueprints, right? So like I've got satchel, of course. He's got like flashlight, a bunch of other and things. Medical surgeons. And medical, yep. Yeah. Oh, welcome, Blizz. So he has the useful stuff is what you're saying. Yeah, he has the useful stuff. <laughs> so his base is through there. There he yeah. is. Okay. <laughs> And this is the base, man. We're, we're, we're roommates. Now, before we commence with the raid, I want to talk to you guys about Manscaped. See, today's video is all about living out at sea on a boat. That sounds like a lot of fun, but if you're not prepared, it could be a nightmare. Sweating in the humid hot summer's heat is exactly how I feel every single day that I'm gaming in my room. Our computers are getting more and more powerful, and with that, our rooms feel like ovens. Fellas, sometimes those rust sessions can last a long time. And that's where Manscaped comes into play. They have the best products on the market for keeping your bits fresh during those long gaming sessions. The latest performance package comes with everything you need. First thing I recommend is the Lawnmower 4.0. This is the best trimmer I've ever used. It's waterproof and cordless, so you can use it in the shower. And it's got an LED light, so you can navigate those blind spots with ease. Also included in the performance package are the Crop Preserver and the Crop Reviver. For a limited time, you guys can purchase just this performance package at manscaped.com you'll get not one but two free gifts the shed travel bag 
and the Manscaped anti-chafing boxer briefs. Go to manscaped.com today and get 20% off plus free international shipping when you use the promo code RANTS at checkout. That's 20% off plus free shipping with promo code RANTS. Your bits will thank you. Mm -hmm. Invite you to the team. You can grab your weapon through... There's, there's a box there. You can also grab yourself some gear from... Just from this, any of these boxes. There's loads of organized gear. Mm. Now, after the three of us got fully prepped and ready for the raid, we headed out onto the seas to begin our new life. All right, let's see. Is the tug... Yes, the tugboat's still there, boys. Come on. Do you have any diamond gear or no? Nah, fortunately not. Oh, we should have brought some scrap. We could have actually bought, bought, bought some here. True, true. All right, lads. So <clears throat> we're going to raid the tool cupboard room first, get TC. And then we can drive. We can kind of just drive away while doing the raid. Okay, hopefully no surprises on here. It's a sheet metal door. Nice. Okay, well, we'll start by going through here, I suppose. I think this one gives you TC. It does, yeah. That's why I, I was going to go. How it works. Go there first. Then we can at least drive it if, we, if somebody comes. Do you have to repair this boat? Yeah, you do, yeah. Okay. Metal and wood, which I brought. Let's go, boys. I'm going to start driving now. Oh, wait. Oh, th I should oh. not have thrown a ball driving it through. It's completely glitched to the left. It's in the ocean. Is it? Is it just gone? Yeah, yeah this is gone. Crap. We're teaching the people of YouTube. Don't throw your satchel while <laughs> driving. <laughs> yeah, it literally just glitched out through it, like, completely to the left of the boat. Note to self. Don't throw a satchel charge while the boat is moving. <laughs> Unfortunately, because of this mistake... We're going to have to craft one more satchel. But not to worry, because White Smith and I have built an automated base, all we got to do is nip home and all of the sulfur and metal fragments is waiting for us. So, one extra satchel charge crafted. Let's go and find out what's in this boat's main loot room. Okay, we're in, lads. Tier two. Oh, some guns in here. Oh, are, we, nice. are we getting this Ooh. to our base or not? Nah, nah, nah. We're, we're on the seas now, mate. You're a pirate, mate. Forget about land. You're never going back on land, White. <laughs> You're with the pirates now, mate. There's somebody on here? Yeah, there is. He's running into us. I shot him. I shot him. He's dead. He's dead. Nice. <laughs> we gotta what get him. What are you doing? What is going Sorry. on? <laughs> See if you can get on there, uh, White. On the other boat. Okay, wait. I think I would get... Okay. Nice. Nice. You did the you did the jump I told you about. Yeah. Yeah, boy. Okay, you had no loot, but how much low grade was in here? 30. Okay, okay. All right, so what we're going to do is we'll probably put all... We'll have all these boxes. We'll have code locks on that we'll have the code to. We'll put a guest code on this front door. We'll put some sleeping bags like in here and then we'll just see if any naked wants to live on here. Okay. Well, we should give them probably at least like a small box each, right? Or something like that. That's what I was, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I was thinking with it. With and they need some amount of storage. With a guest code on it, yeah. I think we probably need to farm some more metal frags and like wood, no? Yeah, for sure. Now, step number one complete. We have acquired our own tugboat. Now, all we've got to do is recruit some guests, and this hostile business of ours will start to climb. Now, before we started our search for potential guests, the three of us went out and did some farming just to make sure that we were fully prepared. The two main resources we need are metal fragments and low grade. A lot of low grade. We want to have enough low grade on this boat to basically give us unlimited mileage across the ocean. Now we ran into a few battles along the way. I kill him. Nice, well done. You insert one. Are you naked? Oh, you're healthy, oh. bro. Nice, bro. Good job. Good kill. Now Whitesmith had to log out for a little while. So Blizzard and I have decided to get to work right away. We're going to search the beaches for fresh Rust players and see if any of them want to join us on our boat journey. There's a player there. See see that on the on the right? I don't I don't have much HP right now, so I'd rather not fight if we don't have to. No, 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 I know that, but I just want to see if he's naked. Oh, if you want to pick him up. Where are we? Let me get a little look at him. He's in the armored base. Hello. Oh, he's got a gun. How you doing? Maybe we should kill him. <laughs> 
I mean, he does have a gun. I don't know. It depends on how friendly you want to be with people, I guess. Well, he doesn't seem that friendly, you know? Hmm. Mm. Unless he lives... I kind of want to investigate this a little bit. I want to see what's going on here. I'm going to depot some of my stuff. Oh, Type you're organizing. Really nice. Hell yeah. Yeah. I'll keep I'll keep it organized. Mm-hmm. Oh, so you're just thinking, well, wh well where are we going to place the guests' beds, you know? All over here. What do you mean? All over here? In the center. Because I kind of wanted yeah, them yeah. to have boxes next to their bed, like in a hostel. We'll see. You could do it like, you can still do it in the middle, just with small boxes. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking, yeah. Yeah, I'm going to mainland a sec. Aye, aye, Captain. How many metal frags have we got at the moment? 1.2k. You good? Yeah, it's killed one guy. I think I killed him. I hit him five times. He's wearing full heavy metal armor, that's why. <laughs> oh. That took a beating. Now, not only did this guy have full heavy metal armor, which is going to come in handy later on, he had a bunch of diving gear. This is right up our alley. Just what we need. Should, should I make the... Should I make those Christmas lights then? Yes, do it. Yes. And by the way, I also have the... And like, I know you're like proud of having them. I also have them. I mean, I'm, I'm not, but okay. So, you know, don't think you're all high and mighty because you've I mean, got you the don't old... have them, though. I right do now, have them. Do you? Yes, I do on this steam. Of course, I transferred everything. Should I prove it? Okay, I will prove there. it. I will prove There's it, boy. Where's the metal frags? There. How many do you want? Just make one. Make one? Okay. Yeah, yeah. I've All right, so... Already. Hang on, I've got to go make a cup of tea. Um, no, oh, interesting. No, 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 listen, look. What's this? What's this, boy? Wait, I'll place it next to it. Apologize. Oh, do you actually have it on this account? Because <laughs> I, I have think it. you transferred it. Mate, where did this is... On the other one, but... Wait, so that means we can place signs in here to make it more known that it's a hostel. We can place a wooden sign. Inside, yeah. I'm not sure about outside, but... We've got to try that out. We've got to try the Christmas lights outside. Now, after some interior design decisions, we began placing down the guests' sleeping bags and, of course, their storage boxes as well. Bed one code. One, zero, nine, nine. We definitely are going to have to get more metal frags, I think. All I these think. code locks. Bed two, seven, seven, eight, two. Guest code for main door, four, nine, nine, two. Okay, all the boxes have got code locks on. Now, this boat hostel is going to work exactly how all my other hotels have worked that I've built on Rust. The guest will receive a note, and on that note, there'll be two codes. One code will be for their box, and the other code will be for the front door of the tugboat so that they can enter and exit as they please. The front door code is only a guest code, which means the guests can't actually change the code because they don't have access to the master code that Blizzard and I have access to. So anyway, without further ado, we have three beds available. Later on, we'll add more, but for now, the boat is ready for some guests. So let's go around and recruit some tenants. Hey man, sorry, sorry, I didn't mean to shoot you. Wait, 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 stop, 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 stop. Where, hello, sir. Yeah, 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 yeah. We, can, we can talk, we can talk. Do you have a microphone? Do you have a base, sir? Would you like to live on in our hotel? We have a hotel. Would you, would you like to live? Follow me. I'll take you to our hotel. I think we've got our first potential uh, guest. He doesn't have a microphone. We'll see. Did he speak to you, Blizz, or not? No, no. Okay. Do you, uh, do you speak English? Privyet. We're almost there. Are, are we even? Are we even charging people for rooms? I mean, I don't no, know. No way. No, we're like hippies, you know. We're like we're like free loving, no, like. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. No way we can charge for the rooms. <laughs> no, this is like free love mm -hmm. type hippie thing where we're living on a boat. This way, sir. This way. Come inside. Over here. Hello, man. Come inside, mate. All right, so this would be where your this would be where you sleep, um, and this would be your box right here. 
if you want to live here. I don't know how much we can trust this guy, but shall I just give him a note? <laughs> I mean, yeah. all right, let. More just sucks that he doesn't have a microphone, but I mean, that's fine. Take this, mate. This is for you. Welcome aboard. Awesome. So this is your bed. The code is on the note. We'll be setting sail in about five or 10 minutes. Maybe maybe 15 minutes. The next stop, where's the next stop? Harbor, maybe? Yeah, bottom harbor. Next stop will be harbor at the bottom of the map. Place the code in this door. Nice. All right, mate, all right. Place the code in this box. And then finally, I will give you this bot. This, well, my friend will give you this bed. We have our first naked. Welcome aboard. Okay, we are setting sail. Okay, that bird's not yours. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's go. And so just like that, we have our first boat hostel guest, JG. Now the goal that Blizzard and I would like to achieve with this hostel is that we'd like to take oil rig with all of the guests. We want to fill this boat with around six random Rust players, and we want to try and coordinate an oil rig takeover with all these random people. So we have guest number one. Now we just have to find five more. The next stop is going to be the fishing village, and then the harbor down at the other side of the map. Whilst we're looking for guests, we also want to try and get key cards so that we can prepare for the oil rig run later on as well. Oh, this is the guy that killed me with the bolt. Wait, you know what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, hello. Hey, how you doing? You're the, uh, is this your boat? Oh, okay. Um, whoever owns this boat, this is awesome. He killed me before. Where is the owner? Have you seen him? Oh. <laughs> Wait. Hang on. Wait, because I can see this guy's got a red name. So if I go to my contacts and look at enemies, why has he got a red name? Um, do you guys... Do, do you have a base? You do? Okay. A naked guy. Swimming in the water somewhere. Hey. Hello. Oh, it's you. It's, it's our tenant. Okay. This is awesome. Whoever owns this boat, man. The thingy cost, actually, like a submarine. Oh, you want to destroy this one? Yeah. Yeah, because I think he's logged off, you know? I think this is I like... I think he's loaded as well. Same. Now, Blizzard came up with an awesome plan right here. See, if we manage to get a submarine, then Blizzard could drive the submarine next to our tugboat out in the ocean. And if any other tugboats or boats tried to mess with us, then Blizzard could destroy them with torpedoes in his submarine. Essentially, we could have our own little submarine security guard. Security is key when it comes to having a successful hotel on this game. So although we might not be able to place auto turrets on our tugboat, we can have something even better, a submarine guarding us at all times, fully loaded with torpedoes, ready to destroy anything in our path. Oh wait. How did he kill you? Oh, you have a microphone. Hello. He kill you. Hello. Yeah, the guy that was on this, the guy who owns this boat killed me with- Bro, what did he do that? When was that? Oh, I was just following him on a little small boat. It was earlier today. Do you know the guy who lives here? Well, that's rude. No, oh, I just saw the armored doors and was invested. Do you want to live on our boat? We have a we have a boat hotel. We have some spare beds if you want to live with oh, us. Really? Yeah, come check it out. I just want to check it out. I'll, I can drop my if you want. No, I'm no, it's okay. Have a look. So we have lights. So the way it works is um we have three beds what? here. This one's been taken. Yeah. These these boxes all have locks on. Okay. So we can just we honestly we'll just give you one. Hang on. Take this, mate. You what can have be, you can have bed number three. So just play. This is your box. So you place the coat. Are you the, a YouTuber? Uh, maybe, maybe. But this is all about the hostel. Welcome, welcome. So what's the plan for that boat? Oh, we don't know. We don't know. I mean, we don't even know if you live on it. Because to be honest, your name is red for me, which is a bit suspicious. Not gonna lie, I do live on that boat. Oh my god, bro! Well, well, how you doing? Yeah. <laughs> doing good. I didn't mean to kill you. We're just no, no, no. Weird. It's just it's like, all, it's okay. Going I mean, oil rig? dude, your boat is awesome, man. You wanna you wanna make a boat alliance then? I'm 
down. Okay, sweet. Are you, can I invite you to the team, yeah, or are you no, already no, in a team? I feel bad. I didn't want to no, kill you. No, no, it's good I'm that you killed me. I mean, I was, people. I was an enemy. Okay, that's fine. I was an enemy. Well, can I have the note back then? Well, like, I'm gonna give it yeah, to someone yeah. else. I didn't change the code. The same one. Yeah yeah, 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 dude. I still feel bad though, because like we were going to large oil rig to like, like go see what was happening, and you just showed up out of nowhere. Well, I was looking for a tugboat actually at that time, and then I saw you, and I was like, oh, that's freaking awesome. Do you log out with your tugboat? Where, where do you store it? If you're gonna store it, you should do it in the safe zone. Okay, cool. Hey, what's your what's your YouTube channel? Uh, okay. I'm, I I kind of have to tell him. Don't say I, a really? random one. Say, say a random one. No, no, no. Uh. I just know that you're say Brit. Say Brit. Brit is easy. Uh, uh, Brit. Brit is my YouTube channel. <laughs> don't laugh afterwards. Okay, now head out. Head out. Let's Dude. go. Brit. Brit. Oh my god. I literally... Bro, I was watching so many of your videos recently. <laughs> I knew I... Oh. Yeah. Wait, Thanks, man. really? I really appreciate that. <laughs> no, no, no. Are you serious? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Brit. Brit. Okay, I'm gonna give you an AK kit, bro. No, well, you want an AK kit or no? Uh, well, sure, yeah, sure. Yeah, I do. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> take it, take it. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Dude, what? Brit, Brit, Brit. <laughs> okay, just stay, just stay like on your boat. I'll bring it to you. Okay. What I've learned is that all you need to be is British and just say you're That's Brit, awesome. and then <laughs> yeah, exactly. you'll get a free AK set, apparently. Well, I think you have to have a good quality microphone and be doing some hotel or like some weird shit as well. True, you true, I mean? true. Like no normal player does this. <laughs> no, this guy must be loaded in there, man. Oh, uh... Absolutely. I, I looked it up though, but if we destroy it, we can't actually get any of his stuff. Really? No. They need like to you fix have to actually that. raid it to get the stuff. Remember, boys. Oh wow, thank you, man. You take that. You take that. Liz. I'm I'm giving it to you guys because like bro, I literally watched one of your videos recently. I've been watching a lot of your videos. And uh Spoon Kid. I just oh, watch yeah, you nice. guys all the time. Nice. Uh dude, I, I watched the I spent fifty hours on the most rotted rust server. It was just so long, it was hard to watch. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I feel like bad. Yeah. I feel bad telling this guy. Bad, really. Yeah. Wait, should what I do just... you mean? You're basically Dude. Brit. It's fine. Should I just tell? Should I tell him who I am or not? No, 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 no. <laughs> Let's get out of here. All right, we're gonna get out right, of here, man. man. Have a good day. Thank you again. We're gonna get out of here. Hey, man. Have a good uh, home. Shout out, mate. Appreciate you. Thank, thank you, bro. No, I feel like I want to tell him who yeah. I am. Like, he doesn't even I mean, know who Brit is, and he's just giving him a kit. Like, he doesn't even recognize no, your voice. I gotta just get tell out of here. I gotta tell him. No, I gotta stop. tell him. I can't. Dude, stop. What hey, do you listen. Mean? We're just gonna. Oh. I'm not actually yeah. Brit. I'm, I'm another YouTuber. My friend wanted me to joke with you. I'm actually called Jordan Rants. No, that's sure. But I, I appreciate you, dude. Yeah. I. Holy. No, he's going holy f again. Well, yeah, because yeah, he's looked well, up the I'm, YouTube well, channel. Well, I'm, and I'm friends count. with Brit, and I'm gonna, t I'm gonna tell, I'm gonna show him this clip because I thought it was funny. Uh, do you still want to give us the AK, or do you want us to give it you back? Yeah, he does. He does. No, all right, let's go. Okay. Oh, you have? All right, all right. Safe, dude. Have a good room. Yeah, mate. Appreciate you, man. An awesome tugboat. Show me. Awesome tugboat. Thank you, bro. He's a legend. I'm not can like you, you please. I can't be evil. <laughs> stay at the front and uh, oh yeah, yeah, I guess you can. Leave. This is so you drive the tugboat. I want to, I want to grab those things if they slide off. Are we going now? Do you want to go now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. See you later, bro. You're a legend. See ya. Okay, now after meeting this absolutely awesome guy by the name of the Ultimate Stove, I don't usually take free loot from people, but on this occasion, I don't know, seemed all right. Sometimes it's better to accept a little gift or whatever. So thank you, Ultimate Stove. Now, it's time to collect some more hostile guests and continue our journey. And we now have the addition of a submarine security guard. Yes. I'll follow you guys in us. <laughs> to submarine. In a, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll buy some torpedoes as well. Okay, I'm back. Actually, can you buy the torpedoes? Because I don't think I can leave it without it being risky. Yeah, I'll buy torpedoes. Dude, we've got 600 scrap. Yeah, I mean, honestly, if we don't have any other BPs, you might as well spend it all, to be honest. Like Now, torpedoes acquired. We are about to meet 
the next hostile guest. Now, quick side note, JG logged out and we never saw him again. He didn't live with us long enough to be counted as a guest, I'm afraid. So the next guest that you guys are about to meet, I'm gonna make this guy the official first guest. Oh, the 260. 260, like way in the distance. No, he's like in the call. Uh, in the, he's not that far away. Hey, naked man. You see him, right, Jordan? Yeah, yeah. Hello, sir. Would you be interested in living in a hotel? No. Okay. <laughs> I asked him if he wanted to live in a hotel, and he just. Well, we have a boat hotel, but yes, it's over there. I don't speak English. Oh, oh, follow me, follow me. He doesn't speak English, but that's fine. Uh, what what language do you speak? Russian? Uh, yes, yes. Uh, ah, da. Okay, look. Uh, Sir, take this. Code for door. Code. No, 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 no. Box. <laughs> this box. This one. It's gonna be hard. No, no, this one, this one. Sorry, this one. <laughs> this middle, middle. Sorry. Yes. And this one. What's his name? Uh, Moko. Moko. Is it the middle one, right? Yeah, middle one. No, other, other code. Yes. Okay. Welcome aboard. Wow, thank you. Okay, спасибо. Привет, мой друг. Спасибо. Okay, we're going, boys. We're going. Now, we've officially recruited another hostile guest, Mako. Doesn't speak English, but trust me, this guy is going to become somewhat of a legend to our hostel. Now, our journey on the seas has been relatively peaceful thus far, but that's about to change. We're about to collide with some fellow sailors, but they don't know what we've got hiding under the ocean. Our little sneaky submarine blizzard. Oh, big, 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 big boat, big boat to the left. Big boat, you can maybe you can maybe submarine it. Oh, Top. I see it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he's already left. Oh, did he get down? No. I hit him. Oh, oh there's a lot. Get he down. He down me. He down me. I'm gonna Blizzard. I'm gonna move Should out. Okay. And maybe if, if if they decide no, to no, follow just get, us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Move, 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 yeah, move. Yeah. Get out of there. Yeah. Because they might start chasing with the boat. In which yeah. case, you could torpedo them, bro. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, Mako died. No. Yeah, he died. And there's a tugboat as well, Blizz. There's a tugboat as oh, well. Oh. Wait, wait, they're actually coming in the boat. Do you they know, if, is it just left click to shoot the torpedo? I have no idea. I'm, I'm, I'm picking up Mako. I picked him up. Nice. Oh, they are following. You're gonna have to probably fight them a little bit yourself as well. Oh, they have their own tugboat. Oh, are they following us in that as well? I can't but, tell. Where? It's right you here, they're right next it. to- Oh god, they're getting on board! Don't leave! Don't leave! Okay, okay. What? Oh, if they're on board, you're Because I can't get out. I don't know if they're on board. The oh, wait, wait, wait. I think they're still driving. No, they're still driving. Yeah? They left because they saw the submarine chasing their ass. Can I have this in the house? Uh... Yes, you have this. Thank you, thank you, Captain. He, he, he likes living here, I think. He likes that he has a sleeping bag. Let me give him... Hang yeah, on. he said he said to you, like, uh, thank you, Captain. I don't know if you heard Did it. he say that? <laughs> yeah. Hey, hey. Yeah, let's continue along the coast then, right? Yeah, okay. I'm just cra I'm crafting ammo for you now. A load of it. Aye, aye, Captain. I'm going to where you're going, Captain. Okay. <laughs> Get the binoculars out, bro. Let's see if we find any yeah. other... Yeah. I'm looking. Mate, I love how they were, like, scared when they saw your submarine, bro. Like, holy... Bro, will them up if they're on the boat. Like, actually, it'll... Be yeah, yeah, yeah. one shot them. You haven't shot a single shot yet, right? I have. No, no, I've shot three of them. Oh, wow. Okay, okay nice. running. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Another tugboat there. Just, yeah, yeah. But yeah, it's, it's hard to aim them. Oh, someone is shooting! They are chasing him! Oh, he is on it, right? Whoa, 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 whoa. Is that on the tugboat? It is, No, right? I think they're in... Some... Okay, I'm gonna hide in the submarine. Let me know if he comes out. 
I just want to find out where well. he's being, where he was being shot from. I'm taking a little look. Okay, they're they're at they're at the tugboat. Yeah, they're at the tugboat. Um, yeah, try, try to get them to bait you, like bait them into chasing you. You know what I mean? Yeah, like maybe drive away a bit now. That'd be so high. I hit one. I hit one. Now, just as Blizzard scared away the last tugboat that we fought against, we stumbled upon another tugboat straight away. These things are extremely popular, and it makes sense. When I recorded this video, this was the newest and latest update. No wonder that these things are super active. But either way, we're about to engage in another chase. Let's see if these guys fall for the bait. Get out of chasing. Just shooting at the moment. I'm going to keep going away just to see if they chase. I'm going to try and bait them as best as I can. Like, I'm going to try and, like, stop at a certain point. Yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly, and then, exactly. Yeah. I mean, if there's smoke coming out of the tugboat, it means it's on, right? Yes, it does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think they're, they're, I think they're trying to get it started. I think they have to, like, deep beach it first. Get ready to, pass, gonna... to fight. Mm -hmm. I got craft myself, like, yeah, double barrel. Like, start going, like, just into the ocean once they start. Because I want to, like, basically block them from being able to retreat. We right? want to get them as far out in the ocean as possible. Yeah, right? yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I honestly don't even see them anymore. I'm gonna go towards the coastline a little bit. Oh, are you out of render? I might be. I don't see the tugboat. Yeah, they're definitely there. I see both of them. Okay, I'm gonna move back. I'm gonna move back a bit. You'll, you should start seeing them soon. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. They're in render, so I'll be in mm -hmm. render for them now. Yeah, yeah. Just start start going towards the ocean then. But I I, I need them to lock on me first. They've not. They don't. I don't think they've seen me, mate. What? Yeah, they're they're going another way. They haven't seen me. Which way are they going? They're going south. Just follow me. Okay. Sh shoot them to get their attention, maybe. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, shoot th shoot at them, White. Just just literally just shoot, or even if you can't hit them. Yeah, they're going... Oh, no, they're going way out in the ocean, dude, now. They're stopping. They're turning. They're turning. Oh, nice. Yep. Moko has a crossbow, so he can help us. Just make sure they can't jump onto your boat. That's like the worst case scenario. No, no, they can't. They can't. But they, they're, they're sort of like trying to do that. You know what I mean? They're cutting me off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Might mean that you might be able to... We're getting close to each other. Okay, okay. Uh... Ah, okay. Are okay, they okay, going okay, to okay. the left? You need to tell me which direction yes, they're going. Yes, they then. are. They're going to the left, Blizzard. Okay, do I then I can cut them off more. Yeah, they are. They are. They're, cutting, they're going your way. One got cut away because I shot him. They are, they are going. They are going. They stopped, Blizz. They've stopped. Oh, I see them. I see them. Yeah, I see yeah, them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, this is actually perfect. Hey, I shot one. I shot one. Okay, nice. Just keep cover. Shoot that crossbow at them, Mocker. Mocker. Unloading on them. Go on, Blizz. Did it hit it? Yeah, yeah, it's hitting them. Oh, go on, Blizz. Go on, Blizz. Oh. They ran you away. Yeah, yeah, you need to chase them. You need to okay, chase okay, them. Okay, okay, chase okay, okay, okay. I'm going to get some more armor. They're gonna start unloading on me. I need to back off. I, I, I think I'm out of torpedoes. Oh, yeah, really? I am. Oh, no way. Now that was a good little ambush from Blizzard right there, but unfortunately he wasn't equipped with enough torpedoes at the time. Next time around, we're going to make sure that Blizzard is equipped with an unlimited supply of torpedoes to ensure that he's got the necessary amount to protect our tugboat and take out any enemies. We tried to chase down this tugboat, but in the end, there was nothing we could really do and they escaped into the fishing village safe zone. Yeah, they're pretty hard to aim. Well, especially once they're moving. If they're not moving, it's not that hard. But... Dude, there's so many tugboats at the fishing village. What is going on? It's kind Pick of it, picking up our picking up our hostile member. Is he on? I think he's on. Yeah, he's on. No. Okay, nice. Thanks, thanks, Captain. Now, we're still on the lookout for more hostile guests, but we're going to slightly shift our goal and place more of a focus on obtaining the keycards to do oil rig later on. We'll eventually pick up more guests as we go. The next stop is going to be Harbour. We've got some crude oil that we'd like to turn into low grade, and we've also got some recycling to do as well. 
Yeah, if you need a tool or anything, let me know. Uh, why I've got a knife. I have a combat knife also. No problem. Okay, nice, nice. Do I take take like Tommy with me uh, and all of that? Mm -hmm. or? Yeah, okay. yeah. Okay. We stop here for 15 min minutes. There, there, there's a very geared guy, 250. 250? Yeah, yeah, 250. I'm pretty sure uh, he, he might be AK kit. I can't. It's hard to. Yeah, okay, I see him. I see him. I think. Yeah, yeah. He's, he saw us. He saw us. Okay. We should fight. We should fight. Yeah. Thursday. There's two guys, two guys. I hit them a lot of, but I'm... I'm just gonna, I'm gonna bait them into pushing down here, okay? Okay. Yeah, um, they're I'm right just, here. I'm standing here with double power. power. Oh! One's pushed down, I believe. Hit him a few times. Go that guy. One more. I've got no one more yeah. ammo. Where is the guy? Down below. I don't see. Oh, I see him. You guys, you need to shoot at him. I'm down. Yeah. Wait. You're down. Yeah. I headshot him. He's dead. He's dead. Nice. HP, I want HP. One HP. Ooh. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Awesome. <laughs> I knew they would get baited by the heavy armor. <laughs> Dude, the heavy armor, man. Good job. Good job, Mako. Mate, that was. Good job. Good job, Mako. Can hear my own voice in his mic. <laughs> That was all Mako, by the way. I'm just saying. Uh -huh. Nah, that was the heavy armor's OP. Captain, give you your stuff. Oh, thank you. We probably should go to. Take this. Look, I don't know. Actually, take no, take this. Really... You need to go back for our tugboat. Yeah, I'm scared that they're gonna come back. <laughs> oh yeah, like as in don't don't use the crude oil here. Don't do yeah. Yeah, but there isn't really another good spot for it. You True. Need to. Were they recycling? Do you want to check the recycler? No, 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 no. They they're coming outside of the zone. Um, I'm oh, going to make boat. some more medical surgeons because um. Good idea. Yeah, yeah, but don't spare a little bit of low grade. Probably like uh, fifty. Fifty. Okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Is, is there any crude oil? I remember. You remember our base, right? I remember you you put all the crude oil in your box at our base, right? Yeah, Smith? we have some crude oil, like, like 200 maybe. 200, yeah. Or more, pretty, I don't remember. No. They are We're here. pretty close to your guys' base, no? Yeah, we are actually. Well, what was that saw just a second ago? Was that was... No, fighting again. Yeah, yeah, there's a guy on the hill. Where's the guy? Mm -hmm. Behind a rock. Mako is looking with binoculars. <laughs> he is as well. What a le mate, Mako is a freaking legend. How's he not dead? I killed him. Oh, there's another one. Yeah. Oh, big boy. He doesn't know about me. Uh, he's, almost dead. he's dead, he's dead. I killed him. I killed okay, him. okay. Oh, lads. It's getting spicy. Okay, so I've killed, I think, three. Blizzard, you've killed one, right? Or was that, <laughs> was that by... Yeah, yeah. Mm, be careful, they might live in that base uh, south from the tower. They live tower. pretty close, I think. Yeah, yeah. It's better to... Yeah, yeah. Oh, fucking hell. I die. <laughs> oh, wait. Oh, God, no. Uh, wait. Somebody come help Mokko real quick, if you can. Oh. What happened? Mokko, spawn in the boat. Thanks, friends. No problem, man. Oh, you speak. Oh, you speak. I tripled him. Oh my god, he's gonna report me. Now we've just attracted a lot of attention to ourselves. Blizzard being the chat he is, just destroyed like four fully geared guys. So we're gonna move the boat over to the other side of the harbor. And it turns out that this decision seemed to have been a bit of an accidental strategic maneuver. Low on Maybe bring a pickaxe with you and uh, farm on the way. Two geared like players, two, two, hang on, comms. Two geared players, 190 near the recycler, uh, looking towards where we were parked originally. Okay, so very close to me. Yeah. Are they at the recycle? You're sure? Yeah, they're at that section. Oh, yeah. Shooting at me. They're there, yeah. One. He's behind, the other one's behind this pile here. Let me reload. Nice. <laughs> Woo! Free gear sets again. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
<laughs> They're so mad. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. This oh, is the most so PvP. Much stuff recycling. Yeah, this is the most PvP action I've ever had in Harbor in my whole life playing the game. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> Dude, I switch to every plate armor every time. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, it's so OP, man. He just peeked me, and then I was in heavy plate armor and dead. There's no chance. We have a lot now. Like, I just got, like, well, 200 scrap on me from that. All these gear sets, loads of extra guns. Bro. <laughs> Blizzard, you're a freaking... I don't even know. You're a, you're a god. <laughs> now, the reason we're waiting at Harbor right now and not leaving... I mean, you would think we'd leave with all this loot we've just managed to get. Well, we're actually waiting for White Smith. See, he respawned back in the base that we built together because in his section of the base, he had stored quite a lot of crude oil. So we sent him out on a little solo mission to retrieve that crude oil and bring it back to the boat. But on his journey back to the boat, he encountered a little bit of a problem, which is going to require some assistance from Blizzard and I. I see two guys, I see two guys. Like two meters uh, near me, and I'm like 30 HP. Are they shooting you? They no, they no, they you. didn't. They didn't saw me, but I think they hear me. Heal, heal up first. Heal up first. I don't have to heal. Okay, I can, I can craft some bandages. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. No Be problem. as quiet as you can. They'll hear footsteps. I'm gonna try and get to you, mate. Okay, I'm waiting till I craft some bandages. Did, did they run past you? Which direction? Uh, did no, they were just I like uh, run up into their home and they just didn't see me. I mean, they were doing something uh, outside of the base. Yeah. Killed one fully. Yeah, I come to you. I just have a crossy mm -hmm. on me, so I won't help you that much. I didn't hit the other guy at all yet. He's up on the hill too fit like. Okay, I'm running, I'm running. Let's go back home maybe. Yeah, you you can go, you can go. Uh, I wanna fight them. Okay. He's dead, he's dead, he's dead. You can come here and loot his stuff. I, I'm that here with you, you mate. I'm here with you, mate. Yeah, I'm no, full. no, no, but that way you can have a gun. I'm full, so never mind. I'm just going back, back to bed, back, back to Harbor. Okay, you, you, there's a guy somewhere in here, Jordan. Try to look for him. I'll, I'll loot the guy up on the hill. Okay, I'm still hearing footsteps. Just keep that in mind in the base. Oh, yeah, yeah, here, here. Oh, another one, another one, another one. Killed him. Unless there's another one. He had a Hazzy, right? Yeah, blue Hazzy. Arctic, yeah, 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 okay. They might live in here, so just be careful. Sure, and you said there's another body you've not found yet. Ooh, yeah, yeah. You have space, right? Yeah, loads, full in, full health, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah, here he is. Oh, killed one. There's still another. There's still another. I'm dead. I'm dead. One more. Killed him. Need you back here. Yeah, it's gonna be hard. You've got a lot of loot, and then so to get here as quickly as you can. Uh, okay, I'm leaving my loot and I, I'm coming to you. Okay. Go straight to your body. I've not looted anything. Okay. Make sure no nakeds can loot their shit. Yeah. Nice. My body is right on you, right? This is you, yeah? Right here. Yeah. Both bodies. Both loaded. Okay, you just cover, cover, cover. I will. Oh my god. Okay. Over a thousand so gunpowder on his body, mate. Oh, that's so huge for us. There's so many guns everywhere. Thousand to low grade, a thousand no. low grade. Okay, White Smith can loot the rest when he gets here. I'm full inventory. Oh, uh, that's massive, and and you're the one that you're the one that scouted us to go to them, them man. That's like the biggest killer today. With a thousand low grade, a thousand gunpowder. Yeah, yeah, that's a good idea that, that I met them. Yeah, man, mm -hmm. mate, you did good telling us about them. I mean, and they and and they were they were no joke. Like when you said you heard a player, I did not expect that. Oh, two guys right ahead of me. I see. Both dead, both dead. Okay. Woo! We've got our, we've got our like hostile guest just taking care of the bloody. <laughs> Hello, Rivet. Hello. Now in the midst of a heated PVP fight, I completely forgot that Mako was just chilling on the tugboat. He could have easily destroyed the boxes inside and took all of our loot, but he didn't. Who'd have thought that this level of trust can exist in a game as brutal as Rust? 
especially considering we've only known Mako for like half an hour, and yet we trust him with all of our loot. There is a very beautiful side to Rust. I just had a good feeling about Mako, and to me, that's all I need to trust somebody with everything I own. We don't have storage for this, not even close. By not the way. even close, <laughs> yeah, mate. Living on a boat, mate. The base hill left, just be yeah, careful. Stop, I don't stop. Stop. Take this, bro. Oh, thank you. Mate, this guy is an absolute legend, mate. I, you know what? Like, I've, I'm almost like, I want... This guy has left us with the boat. He could have destroyed these boxes and took all our loot. And he literally hasn't. You can give him a kid. Hey, hey, hey. Mako. Wow. Okay, we trust you. You are a very, very friendly man. Bro, we have literally got... So much stuff right now. Okay. Um, craft loads of... Cra craft like 10 meds. Why? Um, okay. Uh, 10 meds. You mean surgeries? Yeah. yeah. Okay. I'll craft ammo. Maybe we give Mako a large box and put it in the middle of the room. Yeah, you can. Yeah. If okay. You want One to, yeah. second. Okay. Move out of the way. Blizzard, please. And then guest code. He's in number two. This for you. Same code. Yeah. Good. Thanks. Thanks. No problem. Thanks, you too, very much, Capitan. No problem. Now, a very successful trip to the harbor indeed. Our next stop is back down to the fishing village to buy a torpedo. This time, we're going to research the torpedo and craft a lot of them. All right, torpedoes being researched. Oh, sh <laughs> they're, they're on your boat. Make yeah, sure you are. be careful with the doors right now. One is... One, one have like a... Uh, wow. Okay, I'm gonna go away a little bit with this. Are they on your boat or no? Yeah, one of yeah. them. Is he still on? Yeah, they are still on. Get ready to shoot them straight away. Yo, I was still on that. I couldn't. I couldn't kill them. Don't, don't leave, Marco. Don't leave. Don't stay. Got him, got him. Dead. Okay, okay, nice. okay. Good job, guys. Three minutes. Three minutes. Yeah, it was my bad. I should have should have warned you before leaving the safe zone. But yeah, good job. Killed him anyway. Twelve torpedoes being crafted. Now, hey, Mako, we survived. We survived. Blizzard, I've got some great news, by the way. Mm. I'm gonna I'm gonna show you in a moment. Okay. Uh, bottom left box. Uh, look inside. Oh my god. It crafts three at a time. So when I said I could craft oh, 12, I, nice. I assumed it would say, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why? He's got 40 torpedoes, in case you were wondering. <laughs> Yo. That's huge. Yeah. Guys, actually, I'm hopping off. Uh, okay. I'm okay. going to. Uh, where can I go mm -hmm. to sleep? Can I Anywhere go? here, yeah. Okay. You can go, I go on top of the boxes. That way, you're less likely to die. Okay. Have a good day. Okay, mate. Yeah. yeah. Bye bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. Yeah. Uh, you can come with if you want. We go to a uh, train yard monument. Mia Dom Depot. Mia Dom Depot. Uh, uh, come with. Yeah, yeah, come, come. Now that Whitesmith has logged out for a little while, Blizzard, Mako, and myself went to the train yard to collect the red key card. And on that note, we're about to meet the next hostile guest. We're gonna stop by the river and let's just grab as many pumpkins as we can, restock on food. I'm just gonna go quickly go to the ranch. I wanna see if there's any uh, players there real quick. Hello! There is a player here. Oh, nice. Hello there, naked man. Yo! Yo, do you have a base? No, I don't. Do you want to come and live on a hotel? On a boat? A boat hotel? Free of charge. Come on the journey, Mr. Solo. Uh, where is it? It's at AB5 on the river over there. We already have one ho hostile guest. Follow me. You can trust me. I bet. See what you think and then decide if you want to live there. We're going to go and do oil rig in a moment so you can join us for that. We'll give, we might give you some free loot. Here it is. Jordan? Yeah, he's okay. coming. Okay. Oh, nice. I'll oh, give you a little... Yeah, I saw this tugboat. Yeah, I'll give you a little tour. I saw it driving by. I thought the submarine was chasing 
No, the submarine's just my uh, my protection. It's a very secure tugboat. Oh, we have yeah, submarine yeah. Uh, defense, everything. Welcome, come aboard. Snazzy. Yeah, boy. Hello, hello. Come on in, mate. So this is how it works. You don't need to drop any loot. Keep it. Keep all your loot. In fact, you'll be able to store it away in a moment. Okay, wait, what did I do with the note? There it is. Oh, man. Okay, hang on. All right, so take this note. That has the code to this box. We will give you this sleeping bag. You will have the box, the sleeping bag, and the access to the front door. Okay, okay. Nice, nice. Oh, let me see. And that's it. There you go, bro. Welcome aboard. Feel free to... Uh, hey, let's go, yo. Yo, feel free to leave as you please. And there you go, mate. Enjoy your stay. We're going to be departing in just a moment. Okay, let's go. Right, where are we going now, Blizz? Where were we going? Uh, we should try to look for that one, the one boat, no, out in the ocean. All right, everybody. Welcome solo to the boat family. After acquiring another hostile guest, we headed out onto the seas, this time in search of enemies. We want to put this submarine to use. However, it seems like we're about to recruit some more hostile guests. Mako's back. He'll 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 keep the new guy in check. <laughs> Hello boys! Jump aboard! It's a it's a boat hotel! Hey, storm the area! Hello, 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 bro. Whoa, don't kill anyone! Don't mo Mocha no! Mocha no! I'm resting him! 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 Sorry, sorry, sorry. How you doing, boys? Do you wanna do you wanna join the new player, bro? Do you wanna join the bot? Come follow me! Welcome, boys! This is the 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 hotel. Wow. Yes. You can stay good here. Man, good man. Hang on, hang on, hang on. You're gonna have to make them the beds, though. Wait one moment. Mm, I have to help them out. Okay. Yeah, yeah I'll start to refine it. Do we have anywhere to put these bags? Hey, why isn't it let us place? Oh, we're, we're in the harbor. We oh. have to we're gonna have to move the boat uh, so we can place. We're too close to the harbor. Yeah, we need to quickly feel, get out. Feel, bro. I need, I need oh, to yeah. feel, bro. No, no. Help me, help me, help me. Hello, are you talking, Jordan? Yes, I am. I'm trying to find them, mate. There's one left. He's really low. Got him. Got him. Respawn, bro. All dead? Yeah, all dead. All dead. Jesus. No. Did he have my Don't Tommy on him? I guess yeah, so. He did, yeah. Where are you at, Blizzy? You spawned, yeah. At the back, yeah, yeah. I need him, bro. Okay, move the boat out of here. Get the boat out of here. Okay, we're just gonna move the boat real quick. Okay, I'm back here. Bro. I need to get do, you, do you have heal? Heal. No. Blizzard, have you got some cloth you can give him? Mm, wait. I need yeah, heal, bro. I need heal. Yes, 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 man. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like we got some needy guests, come here, man. Come here. here, cloth. Yes. I need heal. Be careful, these guys have Tommy or uh, Yokas. I'm not sure how much I trust these guys. Really? They do? What? The, the naked guys? Yeah, yeah, yeah. They both have Yokas. Really? Do we trust them? I don't think we do. Right? Uh, he said he was new. Wait, if he's lying, I'm gonna check his hours. If he's lying, we kill him, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. What, what, what's his name? Wait, wait, wait. I need to go to the player the thing. Oh Monster is the one, and the other one is Ali Inc. He's got 280 hours. It's pretty new. It's pretty new. How about the other one? Can't find him. I, 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 don't, I can't find the playlist anymore. The new Steam UI sucks. Oh. Can't. I don't know where it is. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, yeah. monster. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, where's your friend, Ali? Yeah, 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 bro. Pass that to Ali. Thank you very much, bro. Yeah, I don't know if we trust them. <laughs> <laughs> I really don't. There's so much sus, isn't there? We'll give you sleeping bags, okay? And uh, we give you box as well. One second. Okay, okay, bro. Um, go, go, Thank go. you. Hey, uh, Ali. Yeah, yeah, bro. This yeah. here, this here. 
Okay. Okay, drive me back to the harbor because I need to go get the. I need to get the submarine. Okay, and did we get any? We didn't end up getting any low grade, right? No, 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 no. Okay. I, I think we probably have enough to get there. I think so. Lay, let me invite you guys to team. Ali. Okay, okay, bro. As well, there we go. Wait, who's this naked? There's another naked here. There is? What on earth? Bro, bro, we are a trio. Ah, trio, okay. Oh, Jordan, invite this guy. Let me invite you, Funda. Leave team. Yes, Mako. Protect the boat. Thank you. Spasiba. Okay, okay. Okay, last last person we got on here. It's getting a bit crowded here. Okay, lads. This is getting quite hectic. It was to be expected. Now then, so far we have recruited six people to our hostile boat. JG, Mako, Solo, Ali, Monster, and Funda. In total, including Blizzard, White, Smith, and I, there is nine of us officially living on this boat. We are officially at full capacity. All of the beds are filled up. It's time for us to try and complete the ultimate goal. Bring on the oil rig. I feel like it's it's the law of averages, man. So one of these is gonna one of these is gonna. <laughs> well, the three of them, I think. I think yeah. The other two are, are all right. I I, I, I don't think the three trust... of them are very likely to backstab 100%. I'm feeling I, something. I think it would be kind of funny if they do anyway. True. Does this radar actually... Oh, this radar actually works. So when you're next to me, I can see it on the radar. Oh. Yeah, like your little dot. Yeah, yeah. That's cool. Bro, bro, did you hit me? Yeah. Bro, bro. What time is it? What time is it? Like 7 p.m. Oh, you mean in the game? Yeah, yeah. I don't know. It's about to get night, though. Um, Yeah, we'll try and give you guys some clothes. Well, there's a campfire. If you guys... Yeah, there's a campfire, so... Yeah, I got a campfire right here. Let me, let me put some wood on. Oh, oil rig, we go! Telling me it always oh, will be you. You ruined my brother's time. Until the end of my day. Oh, no, no, no. And in my dreams I see... Okay, boys, let's get ready for this. I'm going to give you guys stuff, no, no, no. guns and stuff. The ships. Oh, close. Oh, close. Okay. I, need, I need a gun. Okay, right. Shit, bro. Let me give you guys guns. Yeah, just tell them to be careful at the beginning because you're going to have to clear most of the scientists for them, essentially. Make yeah, sure you yeah, have yeah. a lot of meds and... Okay, Mocker, have you got a gun yet? You good? You have ammo? Captain! Solo, you have a gun? You got some spare pistol? Take this. Take, wait, 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 wait. Okay, uh, wait, wait, wait one okay. second. Okay, solo take this first. Okay. Nice. Okay. Oh, nice. I, I can give someone my pistol, man. <laughs> I do not trust these guys, Blizz. I do not trust these three guys, bro. <laughs> I'm going to tell you that right now. The a pistol on the floor, everyone. Pistol right there. Uh, there you go. Boom. Oh, hello. I'm a Get a little closer. Oh, oh no. Thank you, thank you. Heal, 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 bro. I need heal. Heal, take this. I need a gun. Oh, no, no. I feel like I'm about to die. Oh no, I need comfort. Comfort, <laughs> <laughs> Please, bro. One of them logged out. Thanks, brother. Only 2v1 now. Let's go now, come on. Thompson, oh, Thompson, bro. I, need Thompson. I have, I, you have pistol. I need the Thompson. Thompson. Thompson, please, bro. Oh. I need a Thompson. 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 Go on rig. On Thompson. rig. They will be gone. Oh, go they will be gone. Go go Thompson. Okay, let's go. Alright, you stay down there, Blitz, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, and let me grab the key cards. Oh my god, I'm about to die here. Okay, so we began our oil rig clearance right here. Now, I'm making a little bit of an excuse here, but I twisted my wrist climbing. So, for this whole wipe, it was very hard for me to actually move my wrist, which, believe it or not, hindered my aim massively. Uh, I know I'm not the best Rust player in the world, by any means, but this particular wipe, I was considerably worse without the use of my wrist. So, 
Just thought I'd throw that in there, boys. Anyway, doesn't matter, because we're at the oil rig on a boat, and so if we do die, we can just respawn on the boat. Easy as that. As I ran down into the boat right here to regroup and heal up a little bit, I heard the very ominous sound of a helicopter. It looks like this oil rig clearance is not going to be easy. Helicopter, helicopter. Oh, Mini. 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 They're landing on top. Yeah. I, I put like, yo, I need, I need beds. I'm crafting yeah, meds. Just take that, just take that. Right, Solo. Right. Take that. Okay. Okay. You got clock? Any amount of clock? Like, and. Uh. Alright, let's go. We gotta go. Go, 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 go. So, Ellie, Ellie died. They have good guns, I'll tell you that. You in the vent right now, Blues? Yeah, yeah. Are the, are the other two all dead? Are they still alive as well? There is a lot of people dead here for sure. One's right above me. Mm. Oh, shh. Stop, stop, stop. Captain, uh, please uh, drop uh, medicament. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah, one of them's on helipad, the other one's clearing. Okay. I'm like right underneath them. Okay, nice. So hard to see with the sun glaring in my eye. Oh! Oh! Oh, I have a back time in Albliss. Yeah. So, I think it might be better if. If you stay patient as well, they don't even know you exist. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, hundred percent. I'm, I'm waiting. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm waiting, and I have full plate heavy armor. It's like oh, I'm, really? I'm gonna try and okay. kill one, and then I'm gonna put it on and try to kill the other. Mm, I think the one left the helipad now. I'm on. Mako's on as well. You're both on rig. Oh, I see the guy. Is that you shooting? Yeah. Okay. Are they both up there? Can you tell? No, just one. He's just chilling. Yeah. <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> yeah, like, what's the point? Like, well, I mean... Like, just fly away if you're gonna play like that, I guess. Like, I don't yeah. know. <laughs> oh, no, that wasn't so little bad. Crane. One's on Crane, one's on Heli. Oh, almost got one. Damn it. Oh. One of them's just running around at the top. Oh, yeah. I see him. I see him. I see him. I think I killed him. Okay, nice. Yeah, yeah. I did. I did. I did. I killed one. Only one left. Like, just stay on the bow at this point. One more, Solo. One more. And we got this. We killed one. There's only one more left, mate. Bro, it's so cold. Tell me about it. I'm gonna try and grab my my bit where I died. He's behind like the blue crate on the top floor. Somebody right under me. I think that's one of us. Well, I'm with Solo next to him. You are. You are. Yeah. Okay. Then then head towards like the head towards the red card. Okay, but I don't have a weapon yet. That's the problem. Yeah, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I'm saying the body is there. It's right near Solo. Go, go towards Solo. Solo's about to loot it. It probably has an AK. Yeah, he's looting it right now. Where, where's the last guy? Do we know? No, no, I don't. I thought he was up by you guys, but he clearly isn't. Oh, there he is. I'm, I'm dead. Full dead. He, he was down below near the crane. Oh, Solo's... Go, you can go to the heli. Go to the heli and loot my body. I don't think they looted anything ever. He's dead! He's dead. Solo, you're a beast! Solo killed him. Uh, Solo! Go on, me. So bad here. Uh, yo, whoever's the best, uh, I'll definitely be wizard. And I feel like you're the, one of the best. He is. He's the chat. Solo, you're a god. You're a god, yeah. bro. Nice, nice. Good, good, good. Oh, good, huge. Good, good. Solo! Thank you. Legend. Wait, wait, wait. You need, you need clothing. 
Yeah, I know. <laughs> someone, someone took a white kid. It was like Mondo, I think. Solo's actually good, uh, pretty good actually as well. Like, cause he was getting annoyed that people were making noise. <laughs> Legend. Well, there you go. Solo saved the day. Didn't even know who this guy was a few minutes ago. And now we're all working together as a team and we've successfully taken control of the oil rig. Well, for now anyway. Mate, how did we pull that off though? That, uh, about the amount of hecticness, <laughs> but like, you, no worries, yeah. man. I actually trust the three guys now. Yeah, I, I do as well now. Yeah, yeah, 100%. <laughs> I feel like they could have easily backstabbed at that stage. Yeah. Yeah, you want me to bring low, your low grade up for the heli, right? Yeah, and a bit more ammo maybe as well, just so I can clear the scientists easier. Yo, Blizz, take this. Oh. oh. Okay, somebody, somebody loot. Oh, somebody yeah. did. Take that, in fact. And then uh, that. Now, after the seven of us demolished the heavy scientists, we were close to officially completing the oil rig. But there's one more hurdle left. We're all dead. Okay, boom. <laughs> there you go, mate. Yeah. I'm at the ranch. I'm at the ranch. Good hey, boy. Thanks for joining my, uh, the, 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 the boat. Oh, mate, look at that. Bro. Okay. Okay. Oh, yeah. Got a row of guns. That's so good. Bro, this is it, man. Yeah, I don't need to. Thank you, too. Hey, Jordan, you want this? This is what happens when you join the Smiths, the Smith uh, boat hostel. Right, uh, uh, Solo, you want to help me? You want to help me chuck this heli off the edge? Unless you want to take it, in which case you can. We can take it. We can take it. We can, like, we can park it on the tuggy, right? Maybe somewhere. Really? I don't know. Oh, Solo just came up with a great idea. Because I saw someone do it. Let's see. Let's see. Yeah, I'll test it out. I think that spot. There is a, a couple spots that might be okay. The back's the best, uh, but I need you to pick up that barricade. But I don't think you can here. Then it would fit. No, you if it, can't pick up. No. If it wasn't for that barricade there, it would fit so nicely on the back. Try it. The top is probably your best bet, though, out of all of the spots that are remaining. Oh, uh, Mini coming in. There's one on the helipad, yeah? Yeah. He's looking at me. No, he's looking at me. No, the guy in the heli. I'm gonna see if I can distract him, okay? Yeah. He's up there now. Well, this one guy jumped down. Yeah, he did. He's trying to come on. This guy's so low. I killed him, I killed him. Nice, good job. That's just his friend, I'm gonna land. Yeah, the friend dropped down. Like down here, down here. Okay, okay, okay. You're going back, weapon, weapon. Leave hey, solo, there's one here. Yeah, 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 a guy landed in mini. There's still one guy left. There's still one guy left. But we don't know where he is, so we can just go. One guy Yeah, I got crate. Yeah, got one AK guy. We got crate, right? I killed the other one. Yeah, yeah, we got the crate, we got the crate. Oh, I'm dead. Is that him? Yeah. Killed him, killed him, I killed, killed him. I killed him, I killed him, I killed him. Nice! Is that him? Yeah, him, those him, he killed me. Uh, let me lose that. Yeah, yeah. Did he have my AK or no? He might have dropped because I didn't see it. Okay, lads, let's get going soon. Everybody get on. Everybody get aboard. Get on, get on, get on. Captain, I found a, another AK body and it had rocket. Really? It had rocket? It had a rocket launcher and a real rocket. Oh, sh I've got a C4 as well now. Nice. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. I told you it was going to be a hectic ride, but we did it. We managed to recruit random Rust players from the beach to join together to achieve a goal, and we pulled it off. We took the oil rig. Nobody backstabbed us. I still don't know how. Ali and his friend Monster were definitely very sus. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if you did, consider giving it a like and subscribing. Sometimes if you just give somebody a chance in Rust, you never know where the journey will take you. I decided to give the boat to Solo. He was the only person that wanted to stay online. Everyone else was super tired. And on that note, boys, I'll see you in the next one. Awesome. Blizz, do you want to kind of end it soon or? Let me keep. Yeah, I mean, yeah. We've been playing a long time. Uh, should we just give the boat to... to... Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I gotta go also, like, you know. Okay. Yeah. Me just... Well, Solo, do you want to keep the boat and everything in it? I mean, I guess I can. 
Yeah, dude. You're you're the MVP, bro. You, you, you're skilled. And, and uh, of course, White Smith, you're a legend for living with me. Yeah, it was a good time. Yeah, mate. Awesome. And I hope you keep playing Rust, bro. And uh, awesome. obviously, we'll, we'll, you know, hopefully, maybe we'll, we'll cross paths again in the game. Yeah, yeah. For sure, dude. That would be cool. Yeah. This has been, this is your first week oh, on the game, gonna... so yeah, it's been, yeah. been cool, dude. Nice. Oh, wow. Nice. Damn. I just met him on the beach, bro, and lived, it, lived in a base with him. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, nice. Yeah. Like from zero to hero. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to put the the main code for everything. I'm going to put that in there. It's 4638. Um, and obviously, if you don't, you don't have to keep it as a hotel. You can get rid of the bags, do whatever you want. But yes, nice meeting you, Solo. Honestly, like you, you, you. Oh, yeah, nice yeah. meeting you too. It's because of y'all, bro. <laughs> yeah, bro.